This new study examines the effects of must-access prescription drug monitoring programs, or PDMPs, and recent regulations limiting the duration of initial opioid prescriptions on various measures of use of medical care and other outcomes for workers with work-related injuries. The policies examined were part of an extensive effort by stakeholders at local, state, and national levels to address potential excessive opioid prescribing and opioid abuse. Let me show you how you can use the study. From the table of contents on page four, you can see the major sections in the study. You can click on each of them and the underlying link will take you to the corresponding chapter. The executive summary begins on page seven and provides you with a high level summary of the major findings from this report. Many readers find this section is a good starting point to find the most important messages from the study. If you'd like to learn more about the policies that we examined in the report, please go to section two on page 12. Those who are interested in details of our analysis, you can find it in section four. Here we start with graphs indicating how opioid prescribing changed across states. Then we provi provide results from our statistical analysis. We show results for measures capturing opioid utilization, measure capturing use of other medical care that may be used instead of opioids, as well as duration of temporary disability benefits. We hope you found this video helpful and will download the report. If you like this video, please click on the thumbs up button below. Also, please make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with our latest research and discussions about important workers' compensation topics.